simple harmonic motion. In this lab, we will be using this air track to provide a near frictionless surface for a cart to oscillate upon. At one end of the track, we have a motion detector, which will be watching the flag on the glider. Once we turn on the air from the air supply, air will be blown out of the top of this track, providing the near friction surface, and we can displace our glider and allow it to oscillate freely. Using that motion detector data, we will then be able to analyze this simple harmonic motion. By removing these springs and measuring their spring constants independently by watching them change length as a function of how much weight is hanging on them, we will be able to calculate the spring constant of these two springs independently and compare them to the spring constant from the simple harmonic motion. A few pieces of equipment data that you need to keep in mind. First, we want to try to touch the top of the air track as little as possible. If dirt from our hands fills in any of the air holes or makes sticky spots on the track, it's not going to work as well. To protect our springs, we want to make sure that we never let go of springs when they are under tension. That immediately becomes a rocket and can break the springs. We are always going to gently let the springs go to a relaxed position before we let go. Then we can remove the springs to do our separate measurements or to do things like massing our gliders. When we are taking the gliders on and off the track, we want to be careful to not get them dirty and messed up. We always want to try to place the flag towards the motion detector. During the experiment, we will also be adding masses to the cart to change that simple harmonic motion. These masses can go on the pegs on either side of the glider or in the center, but we always want to add them in a symmetric fashion. So if we're adding two weights, we could have both weights on the middle, or we could have one weight on either side, but we don't want to have two weights on one side, or that rail can start to grind and it can damage our equipment. The blowers are quite loud, so I will recommend turning them off unless you are actively collecting data, so that the room is quiet enough that people can actually think. Thank you for watching this video. Here's a fun fact. According to general relativity, due to the time dilation effects of gravity, the center of the Earth is about two years younger than the surface of the Earth.